Hey, what's up guys? Rado here with Dirty and Iron. So my WR450 is ready for the first test ride after all the free mods I did and after JD Jet Ink uh, that I installed last night. Uh, I'm really excited. It's a little chill today, but it should be fun. So stick around. Right now it's completely cold. It was sitting in the garage. So let's see how it starts cold. Usually I go twice in the throttle pull the choke up and then just hit a starter Sounds good. There was a forestry. These guys checked me last time. So today is kind of cold. I think it's like 40 Fahrenheit. So, because it's a little bit cold, the bike might be running a little bit lean because of that. So, probably today is not 100% what I'm going to get out of this uh, mat. Bike. This bike flies. I hope you guys can hear it on the video. It's really nice throttle response. Still little wheelies. I'm actually still trying to learn how to do this. Sit, sitting wheelie, let's see. This is where the bike, sh bike shines. It's a little bit faster trails, you can just wide open. amazing also on this bike. You can just gas it all the way to the turn and go on the brakes. Go on the gas. So sweet. This thing is a rocket guys. And I have to tell you I'm enjoying these horsepowers here. I'm really enjoying it. Am I using 100% of it? Of course not. But what I'm using I'm enjoying. If I want to explain it, I think it feels like bike is happy. Like every time I give it a guess, it just sinks. It's not something that, yeah, I like that. Every time I hit the gas, I feel that. So I made my WR happy. That's not bad. Let's hit some fifth gear here. Okay guys, second gear, check my throttle. Hey, pulls, instant. So nice. A 
loop this breadboard here. Second gear, easy climb. It was a little steep, a little rocky. So we are back home, a little more dirty, a little more tired and sweaty. Man, I love this thing. My uh, quick first impression after all the mods I did. It was a great bike even before. It had this, it had the great pull, and it was pretty powerful and fast. But after after I did, did this mod, I don't see any major improvement. I don't see that it uh, was a mediocre bike and it became a great bike. It was a very good bike before, and now it's uh, better than it was before. But it's not like a huge difference. It's maybe because I already had my aftermarket exhaust and the throttle stop was removed and the, there was different pilot jet. So this bike was already running pretty well. But now what I feel is that. Uh, it runs a little more uh, free. The sound is way more uh, crisp. It just sounds the bike is happy. I really have that feeling. Anytime I give it a little throttle, it just sounds like, hey, give me more. It's just asking for more throttle. So I'm really happy how this thing runs. It's very smooth, especially from the, from the um, low RPM into a mid range. It has very nice transition. And then when you hit the high, high RPM, this thing just flies. And on, on the video, you saw some uh, four or five uh, gear fifth gear sections and it was just really fast so it's really nice all over bike that you can use for uh, fast trails and for the single track it's not the lightest but uh, it's really it's really quite capable you can do many things on this bike so so far I'm really happy and I'm gonna keep this bike for a little more <laughs> we'll see for how long and uh, enjoy it ride it and see maybe this is a keeper I don't know yet let me know what you guys think. Shall I keep it? Shall I sell it? Do, you know, get something else, can some, get something different. I really want to know what you think about this. And uh, let me know what you think about all the mods I did and how this bike feels to you. Through the video, video you can hear the sound and see you know, how it rides. So, so far, I'm really happy. Thanks for watching and don't forget, whatever you do, stay motivated. See you guys later.